Good to see this fog still. Hanging, hanging tough. Let me just play with the cave's echo real quick to calm my nerves. Hello? Nice. Nerves have been calmed. Where's my flashlight? Oh, that's better. That's better. Alright. It's still locked. Let's get on up here. Climb the rocks. Oh, that's a nice climb. What a climb. Oh, that's such a good climb. Oh, that is a flawless climb right there. Nothing like climbing in a pair of shorts to... Oh, to get your mind off the paranoid thoughts of, uh... I know we don't know what's what? going on yet, but I don't have a good feeling. I don't like feeling vulnerable. It's not like you can just call the police. M most people don't enjoy feeling ones. vulnerable. It's a... It just struck me that it's an uncomfortable feeling, D. Weird like this happened to them happened to Brian. Just oh, the backpack boy? Um... His dad could... I'm sure, I'm, sure, I'm sure he's I'm sure he's fine, okay? I'm sure we don't need fine. D worrying. I'm sure he's fine. I mean, don't you think if this started happening to them, he or his dad would have said something? Yeah, they would have they would have saw something and said something. That it's in the rules. No, nobody is that weird. The moment you hear someone in the bushes or get punched from the shadows, you're getting your boss on the phone. Yeah. Brian is fine. Yeah, Brian's fine. So. It, it was 3 years ago. He's in high school now. He's on summer break. Yeah, he's just yeah, doing kid right. stuff, right. you know, riding bikes, skipping stones, uh, sm uh smashing, smashing uh, mailboxes with baseball bats, giving, giving kids, giving other neighborhood kids uh, wet, wet willies and, and purple, purple nurples and you know, kid stuff. I'm sure he's fine. <laughs> Oh, we got a big, we got a big ascend here in front of us. All right. All right, Hanky. Limber up. Where's the stretch button? Eh, that's good. We'll just do a couple paces back and forth real quick. Get the blood flowing. And begin climbing these rocks. There we go. Ah, uh, like a champ. Like a champ. Nice. Get a little break. Halfway up. Look down to really get the nerves. To get the nerves firing. And one more. Alright. Isn't that what they say? Always look down. There we go. There's home. Do, do I really have to go see these guys again? I kinda just wanna go home. Hey, what about what about the flapjack fire? We haven't we haven't talked about this for a little while. Maybe this'll bring back the good times. Back when we were uh, you know, getting frisky. Whoa, the flapjack fire isn't going Yeah, remember the home. good times we had staring no, at the flapjack fire, D? Doesn't that, that bring back a nice, the warm, fuzzy feeling? All we can do is pay attention to it. They're not going to try to put it out? No, not they're just going to let it burn? Uh, all right, well, I guess the flapjack fire moment between D and I has, uh... Well, it's burned out, ironically. But... I guess that's okay. It's just a just a metaphor. Just a life metaphor. Enjoy things while you have them because they don't last long. Okay, now it's time to start heading south. Cool. Where's the come? Where's the come pass? There it is. South. We're going south. Um, now we're going a little west. <laughs> okay. Time to hop some river rocks. Okie doke. Jump. Henry, jump. You know, Henry is surprisingly nimble for his, uh, for a man of his stature. It's pretty impressive. Well, except on that one, he kind of missed the rock entirely, but, you know, yeah, yeah, it's overall a pretty good, a pretty good... I feel like, isn't this one of those deja vu moments? Haven't I opened this already in some alternate universe? I feel like I have. It feels strangely familiar. 
I feel like there's gonna be a book in here, maybe a couple of books, a roll of TP, and I have this strange urge to throw the books in the river. Right? Yep, there they are. Yep, Jane Eyre. It's kind of like Jane Austen. That that was that was the author's name I was I was searching for the last time I was here. <laughs> I remembered it. <laughs> Later on, one chance to die, one chance to drown. How about that? There we go. Nice. Callbacks. Toilet paper? And you know what? I'm going to keep that in the box. No need to Go! Oh, I didn't even notice. We got a note. But first, let's copy down this map information. Cool. Okay. Note time. All right, another one from 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 Dave to Ron. All righty. Oh, yo, what's up, Ron? Got man, I I really wish the powers that be uh, could issue us some radios that didn't just suck big old buttocks. Uh, most of the time, I, I prefer to keep things pen to paper. You know, old school, old school. Dave here likes likes a little uh, graphite to uh, graphite to paper. A little, a little, a little, a little, a little pen and papes. A little old pen and papes, Dave. But uh, you know, once in a while, it'd be nice to get a hold of you right away. That's I just want to hold you, Ron. Anyway, um, yeah, my sister. Uh, my sister keeps she keeps leaving me messages at the main office, but I. I don't think she gets that I took the job so I wouldn't have to deal with her or mom. It's like, Jesus, family, you know? Uh, they just want to talk all the time and share their problems. Uh, like, they, we love each other or something. It's fucking annoying, Ron. Uh, but I've been sitting at the spot, you know, our spot. I, I've been sitting at the spot for a while now, thinking about what to say to her, but... You know, I'm a quarter way through this bottle of fifes instead, and I got half a mind to call her back and tell her to go fuck herself. Uh, what do you think? Is, is that the right play, Ron? Or should I write her a note because I am old pen and papes Dave? Uh, but anyway, I'm rambling now. Uh, I just miss you, man. I miss you, and I want to get a hold of you right away. Dave. <laughs> uh, Dave's got some family troubles. I feel like you can make a whole separate game just about Ron and Dave. Recent burn. Uh, I am at the controlled burn. Seems to be under control. I found where they did the controlled burn. I can hike right through here now. Yeah, normally they wouldn't do that so close to a body of water, but I think they're extra worried about a fire jumping the river hmm. and burning up to two forks. Now that there's Wouldn't that be the perfect well, place I'm to do a controlled burn? Because you have, like, you, next to the water would be a natural barrier. Right? Got it. Seems like the perfect spot for a controlled burn. You get a little, uh, natural help. What happens if the controlled burn gets out of control, D? You know what happens then? What happens if a controlled burn gets out of control? Someone gets fired. Ha! <laughs> nice. Nice. Fired. Ugh, are you serious? Oh, come on. That one was an honest accident. Sure. I'm sure it was. For wordplay. That's how wound up all this shit has me. Mm. You can't fool me, D. You can't fool me. You love the puns. You love the puns. That's why you love old Hanky. Let's see. Well, now I'm in a me Is this the... No, this isn't the Wapiti Meadow. Um, it's a meadow though, uh, but now I'm need to consult the map because I'm no longer on a path. Um, find firefighters in Old Scout Camp past controlled burn. Roger that, Captain Map. Um, so what is that? That's that's just that's that's east. Got to go. Got to go this way. Ooh, what is this? Do I do I really need to tell Delilah about about this signpost? I oh, it's more I'm telling her about uh, the pond. There's an old 
pond out here, not much more than a pile of mud. Uh, do, do you have it on your map? Uh, you have this pile of mud on your map? Where, you are. where am I? Where am I? Pork pond. Pork yeah, pond! I sign up for it, but, um, <clears throat> well, folks kept stealing it. Why is it called Pork Pond? Is it because it's called Pork Pond? Uh, because it's called Pork Pond. Is that kind of why... Goddamn name. That sign would look great in a den. Or right? Same reason... Anywhere. They don't really have, like... Signs always get stolen to say, like, 420 on them or something like that. Just damn kids. That was probably Brian Goodwin out doing kid things. See? This is evidence right here, D. Brian Goodwin is uh, alive and well. He's stealing pork pot, pork, 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 pork pond signs. So Kid stuff. So scout camp anywhere near pork pond? Yeah, it is. Just keep heading east. You'll Copy. cross a small ravine and you shouldn't be able to miss it. Hmm, I shouldn't be able to. Well, that sounds like a challenge. But what about this snowmobile in pork pond? Out here. That's crazy. Someone porked himself right Looks in the like middle of this was pond here. Pork pond and dumped it. Yeah. That was not a fun hike back to civilization. Can I go in Pork Pond? Anything I can salvage? No? No, no. Oh, ooh, what are these little are they fish in Pork Pond? Little pig fish? Cool. Some sort of mut mutated fish? Fish that tastes like pork? That'd be cool. A fish that tastes like pork? Scientists, get on it! 